Hey everybody, welcome to another exciting random unboxing here at A Week in Geekdom. Sorry for the audio, uh, but I just had to geek out over something really cool that I got. But you already know because of the video title, so <laughs> let's go ahead and do this. So this is the most unorthodox video game unboxing ever. I am unboxing the Sonic Mania Collector's Edition, and it's actually for two complete uh, different systems. Here's the game, which I got a long time ago. You might have seen it in a haul video. It's a Sonic Mania uh, Plus. For the Switch, it, um, I don't think I, have I shown it? I don't know. You get the reversible cover, the games inside, and it also comes with uh, the art of Sonic Mania. Wonderful gold foil. I was under very different circumstances when I got that game. I didn't think I was in the right state of being or right state of mind to acquire this little thing right here, but I finally caved because I didn't realize at first how cool it actually is. I don't think I've openly talked about video games on this channel much, uh, but uh, I never played the Super Nintendo in the 90s. Instead, my console was the Sega Genesis or the Mega Drive or whatever the hell you want to call it. The Sega, Sega thing, the Sega Genesis. <laughs> um, it, it, I have so many fond memories of playing that system and the one character more than the Nintendo stuff, the one mascot that I'd love wholeheartedly. And, and even though the games, most of the catalog sucks, um, is Sonic. He has been the one constant in my life and the one fictional character that I really, really love from a very young age. And to this day, I get excited when new Sonic stuff gets announced. Even though that new movie looked terrible, uh, but uh, regardless, um, the movie trailer, I had to get Sonic Mania because it's, you know, HD remake of the old games and all that stuff. Uh, and it is a really fun game. I love playing it so much. I was watching a couple of videos on the subject on uh, Sonic Mania, unboxings, retro gaming, one thing led to another. And I am on sort of this. Uh, high, I'm on sort of this high when it comes to video games, like I'm back. I gotta give a massive shout out, and I will do so in a separate video to folks from the Facebook uh, Omnibus group, they know who they are, that got me back into gaming, plus a couple more uh, YouTubers that I've been watching. Uh, but I'll talk about that in a separate video with something I'm cooking up. Uh, you'll just have to wait a little bit longer. Um, I don't know why my voice did that, but here is the collector's edition of Sonic Mania. Uh, <laughs> this thing is amazing, and you're probably wondering, what the hell, if Xbox One? I do own an Xbox. The, re the reason is, I already have this um, uh, for the Switch, so I don't, I don't really care. Uh, <laughs> so I got it for whatever system I could find, and this collector's edition was going for cheap online from a third party um, for the Xbox One. It doesn't have the game because I am sensible and I do own the game already. Uh -huh. So I got all the goodies inside. So uh, you've already seen this from so many other YouTubers uh, that have done better videos than this on it, but you can see it from this angle over here all the contents that are inside. Uh, the back with info on the game. There's a cool image of Sonic right there. Nothing at the bottom. Logo, logo on top. Let's open it up. Can you imagine if I break this? Oh, that would be hilarious for you, not for me. I mean, it's not like super expensive or anything, but it does have value. For this nerd. All right, so box is exactly the same thing, just without all the advertising for the game. 
Except on here. How, do you, how the hell do you open this? This? Oh. <laughs> All right. I'm such a professional. Look at that. We're supposed to get the code to download the game. Statue. The fake uh, Mega Drive or Genesis cartridge. And a metal tin card. All right, so you, I don't think you can barely see it, but that's the tin card. You get the cartridge, looking pretty awesome. And when you pull it out, <laughs> this is the coolest thing ever. Like nine year old or 10 year old Geo would be freaking out if this, uh, if he would have gotten this way back in the 90s. I don't know how old I was when I played first played Sonic, but a gold replica ring. This this is that is pretty cool, and it even sort of kind of sounds like it when you drop it. Sort of, I don't know. That's cool. It even has the uh, board, the chipboard right there. That's awesome. Here we go. This beautiful replication of the uh, Mega Drive or Genesis, whatever you want to call it. High definition graphics, nothing at the top. It's fairly hollow and light, but man, does it look badass. I love Sonic so much, and this is just freaking fantastic. There's a little scuff on it, but that's okay. Mega! How amazing is that? Am I gonna get a copyright strike from Sega? I don't know, but still. Mega! I love it. <laughs> That's fantastic. It has a volume meter that you can't really use and it makes a lot of sound. And a reset button that doesn't work. But still, a worthy item for any Sonic fan. It looks pretty friggin' fantastic. I love it so much, man. Um, this is my favorite look for Sonic. Uh, he's not too tall, not too tiny. Um, sort of midway chubby <laughs> Sonic. I love it. It's awesome. Um, yeah, this is pretty great. I don't know if you guys enjoyed this type of video. I certainly did. I, I, I love Sonic the Hedgehog and the franchise and all the characters. I am looking to get a companion piece for Tails. I think I found the right one. If you know of any, let me know. Something that is in scale, more or less, so I can have the whole gang. And if there's a Knuckles, gonna go after it as well because I love those three characters so much so yeah guys thank you so much for joining me in this weird unorthodox unboxing of the Sonic Mania Collector's Edition thank you so very much for liking commenting and subscribing follow me on social media and yeah I'm gonna go ahead and play a little Sonic Mania and I will catch all of you on our next episode Now here's a little...